Hi guys, hey y'all. Okay guys, so as you guys know, it's hot. I'm starting a video, it's hot. <laughs> in the middle of the day, guys, in the afternoon time, which is I hate afternoon, okay? I bet you guys are like, oh God, what does she like? She hates so much of stuff, but there are actually a whole bunch of stuff that I like, but I hate summer, okay? And it's summer. So anyways, it's hot. I hope it rains, pour down so it can cool down, guys, okay? And I gotta start being more consistent with my videos, yes, I know, because my last time was like a month ago. But anyways, guys, this is my hair just back in a puff ball, natural puff ball, because you guys know that I love being natural, okay? And so, today I got something else, not just my hair and the weather, but my nails. I did my nails. Um... They might not, you know, be perfect and everything and stuff. But guys, I love being natural. So, um, I'm trying to make my nails grow. I'm not sure yet because I was trying to do this for a while, guys. And they always end up breaking. Do you, what do you think? You think I need to drink more water, more milk? Because these two things I do, you know, incorporate in with my diet. And it's getting hot, guys. So, as you know, as always, I gotta wipe my face and stuff. Alright, so anyway... Um, on with the video. All right, so this video today, guys, is going to be about having, um, I'm not stuck up. Okay, excuse me. I was about to say something else, but I'm not stuck up. Okay, guys, so can you believe, guys, that some people think that I'm stuck up? Like, after looking at my videos, I know you guys basically really don't know me unless some of you do know me, but I am not stuck up. But do you know that people will assume that you are stuck up? You know, and then I'm going to tell you. Now, I don't care what people think about me. I do, but I don't. Which means, let me explain what that means. I care to the certain extent of I don't want to hurt anybody. Like, you know, hurt anyone's feelings or make them feel like, feel something about me is true that isn't true. Or if I'm coming off a certain, a certain way, like a bad way. Like, I don't want to come off to be mean rude you know have a bad attitude because that's not me okay so that's why I would like to make people aware like people I care about people I know people that know of me I would like to make them aware but I don't care because I'm still gonna be me so after I make you aware some of you might not even get it you know and you might not you still might go off your own assumptions but as long as I awareed you then that's what matters to me because I'm pretty content, you know, with who I am. I'm a good person and, you know, unless you make me upset and I have to defend myself and stuff like that, guys, then I don't care. You know, I'll be mean and I'll be rude and all these other things that you may call me, but I'm not stuck up and I don't like being called stuck up. But, you know, if you have your own opinions, that's fine as long as I know who I am, okay? Not to say that people are actually calling me stuck up, but that's what I feel, you know, and I, I just know it. But actually, once I got into a little altercation with one of my friends and, you know, they said stuff like that. And, you know, I didn't really like that, even though I know it's not me, but I, I was like going through my soul searching journey. I was like, I wonder, does anybody else feel this way about me? And what would make that person say something like that? when they're supposed to know me a little bit you know nobody completely knows me but you're supposed to know me enough well enough for us to be friends you know so that's what you feel but i don't care but i'm making it aware like okay so um and this is what i have come down to this conclusion okay i'm not stuck up never have been i see you know i see why sometimes people might be like oh well she's stuck up she's so stuck up and stuff here's why guys okay and i wrote them down it's hot but i wrote them down guys all right so number one um and i i have all this stuff in common to make somebody feel like i may be stuck up okay because i don't i don't really want anybody to think that i'm stuck up because i'm not okay Number one, if you, a lot of times people that are stuck up, I notice if you have confidence about yourself, like confidence in yourself. Now I can stand 
a little more confidence to have a little more confidence but when it comes down to stuff like having confidence like oh i'm beautiful i'm always gonna think that i'm beautiful guys i'm always gonna think that i'm gorgeous and the most prettiest woman in the world okay you can't take that away from me and that is great that is a great quality to have now it has nothing because a lot of times this needs to be addressed if you have confidence like me and feel like you know you're the prettiest woman in the world and you have a lot of confidence about your looks or something a lot of people take that in the wrong way like if I fix myself up really nice and I'm like oh I look gorgeous today and I want to dwell in that moment and act like I look gorgeous what does that have to do with anybody else so I feel now that I think that I'm better than you because I feel good about me fixing myself up you know to help me ment mentally and physically it has nothing to do with you when a person has confidence in them themselves okay so a lot of times if you have confidence in yourself a lot of times people are like oh they're so stuck on themselves they're so stuck up but sweetheart you better be stuck on yourself and not be too selfish because nobody else is going to be stuck on yourself like you okay it's okay to feel I don't need my tissue I'm starting to sweat but no one else is going to feel those ways about you other than you or more than you okay maybe in some incidents some people probably could feel more you know but you should be uh, as I always say you should be your first person for everything okay so nothing is wrong with you feeling like you look good okay doesn't mean that you um you are stuck up now unless you are actually meaning oh i'm better than you i'm prettier than you no not no don't do that all right but you can look good and feel yourself okay now number two people think that you're stuck up because you have mental issues okay underlining mental issues and when i say underlying is because you know about your mental issues but maybe they don't so let's say you have social anxiety like one time i thought that i had a hundred percent of social anxiety but i i'm not i don't have social anxiety a hundred percent i have social anxiety like 50 to 60 percent okay because i realized um, social anxiety is not the whole blame of how I carry myself or how I react to others um, some of it is just me naturally but I do have it 50 somewhere between so okay if I say somewhere between 50 to 60 percent I'll just leave it as I have social anxiety like maybe 60 percent okay because I do have some social issues where I feel awkward all right so when people have social anxiety they come off as mean rude they get called they have bad attitudes you know something's wrong with them or something no nothing is wrong with them they're just dwelling in their own problems but something actually is wrong they're having a hard time socializing um they can't keep up in social situations they feel awkward you know there's a lot of social like a lot of stuff going on all right so in that area are in the mix of everything there's a lot going on that you don't know about so they're not actually being stuck up i don't know why and i don't know how this video is going to come out but i hope it's okay but it's starting to freeze so let me hurry up because that means i don't have much time all right so yeah they could have a mental illness that's all like social anxiety is gonna allow people sometimes to make you feel like you're rude and better than others and stuck up but that's not the case they're just struggling inside socially okay guys all right which I will do a video about having social anxiety soon also so number three people might think that you're stuck up because you stay off to yourself like me I'm a quiet person by nature okay I'm always gonna be quiet because I love being quiet if I express every thought that I have guys being a very weird person and not caring about the fact that I'm weird I might be dead and so on okay now I was always a quiet person but like with people I know I would express like everything that I feel you do you know how many arguments I used to get in for expressing 
like so much and couldn't feel like I could hold stuff inside guys so I got tired of that and I got even more quieter okay but I like being quiet minding my business because I don't talk to T Sue and Robert and Tony and Jane like doesn't mean that I'm stuck up I have my set of friends that I talk to and so people might be like oh well she talks to them all the time and she's so like outgoing with them you know only outgoing with them and you know she jokes around with them it's not so she must not like me it's not like that no I am very open first of all to friendships of from anybody if anybody comes along I'm not gonna really necessarily say anybody it depends on what you're trying to do like you know but I'm open for for positive positive friendships with people like if you talk to me I will talk to you but the natural me is just quiet but I'm gonna be different with my friends because these are people that I'm comfortable like I'm not 100% comfortable with anybody but I've grown to be comfortable from knowing them and we relate to each other and stuff like that so of course when you see me with them I might be a little wildish having fun with them because I know them if you become my friend then you will see the difference that I would be the same way okay so I'm not stuck up I'm open to friendships guys it's just not to say that I probably might make the first move or anything but I'm open because I have a bit of social anxiety okay all right so I'm out there with my friends but I can't be like that with you until we become friends if you understand but there's no harm in you and I like you or maybe it is some people that I could care less about but they know why okay and so guys that's all I'm I'm just a different person you know I feel very unique and different and I'm not crying this is sweat <laughs> So I think I'm going to have to end this video. If it does end, guys, take care. Be safe because I know it's going to cut off soon. All right? But I will talk until it cuts off. But just, you know, don't care about what people say because I don't really care. I'm just trying to set the record state straight, you know, that we are, we people are have out here like having social anxiety and having problems and people are judging us. Saying stuff like, oh, they're mean, they're this, they're rude, and they don't like me, and well, you know, they don't act right and then start trying to bother you or something. You know, like bully you because, and look, meanwhile, you're over here like, I have social anxiety, you know, I have a lot of social awkwardness going on, I don't know, the vibe is not there, which is another thing, guys. I don't vibe with a lot of people, like... I'm different and I know a lot of people don't understand me and I'm content with that and I'm fine. I love being me. So it doesn't bother me that people don't understand me, you know. I mean, it will always feel great if somebody does understand. But I'm fine with the fact that nobody really understands me, okay. So I don't understand a lot of, um, some, some people I don't understand. But I do understand a lot, okay. I understand more than the average person would understand but some people I don't match their personalities doesn't mean that I'm being stuck up or anything I just don't match your personality like I don't know how to respond to what you're saying or I don't like everything that you say I could barely understand and I know some people like that and I do I associate with some people that I don't you know understand not a thing they're talking about or they say something and maybe others get it but I never get it you know like sometimes I just never get some people and sometimes I get a lot of people and I like I said I know people don't get me because I'm weird but it's okay so like I really don't care what people think about me or anything but like I said while I'm doing soul searching it's making me look at myself and seeing how others are seeing me and stuff like that although I won't transform myself and change myself to be something that other people would feel comfortable with or stuff like that I feel I'm doing great just as long as I'm not embarrassing people making people feel bad harming people offending anybody or stuff like that but that's what you need to do you need to step back sometimes and look at people that you call or let's say you judge because you shouldn't be judging anybody but look at people that you judge and say they're stuck up 
they don't like me they think they're better than somebody when that's not the case sweetheart okay the case is they might be suffering mentally um wait they might be suffering mentally oh god guys it's getting horrible now i'm gonna have to go in the house but they might be suffering mentally with social anxiety or uh, or another other mental illness which may not makes them crazy but makes it hard for them to socialize with people um are they confident about themselves or just whatever but if you talk to them they may treat you good like just don't judge people assumptions have never gotten people anywhere 